Hello friends, welcome back to CAD practice. Today we are going to construct a practice 3D model in Autodesk Kinetic software and learn the Autodesk Kinetic basic commands. So let's get started. Go to new, take a standard part in millimeter and go to create. Now take a 2D sketch and here we will select the top plane, the exit plane, rotate the view, take here circle command and take center point circle. From this center point, make a circle of dia 160 mm. Go to 3D model, take extrude. Here we are going to take extrude of 11 mm. This will be a single direction extrude and press OK. Now select this top face, go to create sketch, rotate the view, take circle command. From this center point, make another circle of diameter 80. Finish sketch, take extrude. Here we are going to take extrude of 28 mm and press OK. Now, here go to part 3. I have constructed this base and this base. Now, we will construct this pattern profile and this cut profile. Go to part 1. For pattern profile, select this face, go to create sketch, rotate the view. Here from rectangle, we are going to select center to center slot. We are going to select this center point and make one slot profile. Go to view, visual style. Uh, go to view again, visual style, change it to wireframe. Now it is clear. Go to sketch, go to line command and make a horizontal center line. Okay, and escape. Select this line, make it construction, go to dimension, define the angle here at 45 degree. Now define this radius of 14 and the center to center distance here will define or you can just define by the pitch circle dia. So go to circle, take center point circle, from this point join this end point and scale. Select this circle, make it a construction geometry, go to dimension and define the diameter here as 110 mm. Okay. Now here go to circle command and take a circle here of dia 14, make it 14 dia and finish sketch. Go to extrude, select this profile. Here we are going to take extrude of 24 mm. Okay, view, visual style, change it to shaded with edges. This will be a joining profile and press OK. Now go to home. Now here go to top view. Now you can see this is closing profile, but I want a through hole. So I will select this top face, go to create sketch. Go to project geometry and project only the circle profile. Finish sketch. Go to 3D model, take extrude, home page, and here I'll take cut. And from here I'll take all. So this will be a through cut and press OK. Now I want a pattern of this, this profile. So I'll go to circular pattern. I'll select here extrude 3 and extrude 4. Go to rotation axis, select this profile. Here I will take a count of 4 and press OK. OK. Now here I will make a center cut. Go to origin and here you can select XY plane. Go to create sketch. Go to view, visual style, change it to wireframe. OK. Go to sketch, take the line command. From this center point, we will start till this top face, okay, and make the profile. Select here, make one profile here, like this, here, here, and here, and joining profile, okay. Now go to dimension, here, give this dimension as 35 mm, okay. And the middle dimension here will be of 15 mm. 
and the bottom from the center will be at 30 mm okay now here we'll define the distance this will be of 10 mm and this will be of 5 mm now finish sketch take revolve the axis of rotation will be the center and here we'll click on cut go to view visual style change it to shaded edges now press ok now you can see the hollow profile ok now here go to part 3 now we have constructed this this profile now we are going to construct this cut profile go to part 1 here again click xy plane go to create sketch take here the two point rectangle and make the rectangle profile mm -hmm. okay and here go to view visual style change it to wireframe go to sketch take here vertical constraint select the center and select the center go to dimension define this as 20 mm and define this height as 5 mm go to 3d model take extrude here i'll take symmetric cut and here i'll take cut profile the distance here will be all so this will be a through cut both sides go to view visual style change it to shaded to the edges and press ok now i want a similar profile this side as well go to 3d model go to circular pattern again here take extrude 5 go to rotation select here take count of 4 and press ok ok now i want cut out on this face select this face go to create sketch here go to rectangle and take here center to center slot and make this slot profile go to dimension here this center point from the complete center will be at six, uh, 35 mm or take it as 65 mm okay this center center will be of 35 mm and here the width will be of 16 mm now go to vertical constraint select the center and here select the center go to 3d model take extrude here i'll take cut so this will be a cut profile and press ok now here go to circular pattern select extrude 6 go to rotation axis select this face take here count of 4 and press ok ok now we want to give radius to this edges select this edge take fillet take radius of 2 mm select here select this this rotate select here here select here rotate and select this press ok ok go to home view now we'll define the appearance from here we'll take the blue wall paint glossy so this will be the final output this was a basic tutorial to how to construct a 3d part model in autodesk in software i hope you like the video if you do that please do it like and subscribe the channel for more such videos thank you